Hey everyone, it is Crystal with Pineapple Papers and it is the 25th of February, which also happens to be a Sunday, which means that the Sketch Sunday crew and I are playing along with Sandy, who is state goddess and a scrapping reflections uh, here on YouTube and Instagram. And we are playing along with her follow a sketch February. So the sketch that she has picked out for us today uh, was made by Jenny Evans. And she, it says it's Boys Rule Scrapbook Kits, which hmm, I've never actually heard of them. I wonder, I wonder if that's even still a kit club. So um, I don't know how... The sketch doesn't have a date on it or anything. Uh, so in the sketch, there's kind of this like big band. And I decided instead of doing paper, I was going to grab one of my pre-made mixed media papers uh, that I did kind of like a rainbow-esque um, colors of shimmers. And I have three photos of my, well, one photo of my husband and two of some waterfalls. So I'm going to do him as the large picture and uh, the two waterfalls as the smaller picture. So I'm going to mat them with actually a piece of paper from Pink Paisley's C'est La Vie uh, 6x6 pad. I have almost actually uh, finished this paper bag. So I've actually kept it on my desk with my black and white scraps. Uh, the, the pieces are quite neutral, as you can see. Um, it doesn't really give a whole lot of color. It has this like uh, kind of grid with diamonds, but it's very subtle. So I'm going to go ahead and map my photos with that. And then I went off screen and grabbed a couple of different embellishments. And my idea is to do tone on tone. Now, that banner that I just put up there is orange and pink. It's, it's not yellow. So that's probably the only piece that's like definitely in your face as different. I was contemplating using some of the cut aparts. Uh, and layering them around the photo, but I really love this background, and I don't know why I'm like, I don't want to cover it up. I can make another one. It's not like, it's not like I didn't make this one myself, though I know how to do it. I could do it again, um, which I probably will, because I think it'll be quite fun to um, actually use it on the vertical instead of the horizontal like I've like I've done it this this time. So in the sketch there are several stars that just cascade through there and I've decided I'm going to use hearts. So I have these hearts they're from Hip Kit Club and uh, they have a good variety of color. They're kind of missing uh, that that blue green uh, but they have plenty of the yellow and the pinky purple so I'm going to get a couple of those on there and just kind of scatter them about as you see in the sketch and then I, I really want a few other things so I found this chipboard piece that's yellow that says enjoy I don't think I find any other chipboard. So I'm just going to go through all of my sticker sheets, see if I can find anything that works in the colors and the thought process. So this piece said, enjoy. I like these little hearts. I'm going to put those up there by that love this banner and go ahead and stick that down because uh, I know for sure it's going to go there. I'm looking at a couple of these label stickers, but they're not going to work. I grab the Puffy Hearts from the Happy Days collection, and I get quite a few of those on because they have the green and they have the blue and they have the purple. 
they have every color but the yellow. I don't, yeah, I don't get any, any of the puffy hearts in yellow. But I'm just going to scatter those about, especially the purple. I think I get four of those on. So that's exciting. And then for my title, I have this Better Together, um, which probably would have worked pretty well with a picture of him and I, but the color was just perfect. And, you know, my husband goes well with waterfalls because I love waterfalls. So we're just going to go with it. So that's going to be my title. It goes up there at the top. Now I got to glue everything down because I, uh, I, I really don't want things to move. And I just use my tape runner, <clears throat> but it is on all that mixed media. So I might try to stick some Nouveau Deluxe adhesive behind it uh, before I put it in the album just to make sure that not everything falls at the bottom. So... That would be an interesting shaker page, right? I think that when things fall fall to the bottom, you just, it's just a shaker page. <laughs> okay, it's kind of sad too. Now I have these florals. I believe they're from Joann's. Um, and I'm trying to put them color coordinated. Some of them are going to mix a little bit uh, that that kind of pinky one was perfect because it had kind of a greenish teal leaf. And so I could aim that towards, towards that color. Um, and I'm going to do the same with, uh, there's like a yellow one and it has that same color leaf. So I'm going to do that. I go through the actual florals that come in this particular kit and I find one, um, and I kind of think I would have liked it more at the bottom of the photo, uh, but I stuck it down with Nouveau Deluxe Adhesive. So it's not going anywhere. <laughs> it is stuck down there and it is staying there. Now I'm gluing on my my title and it, it wants to pop up a little bit. So I'm going to put my uh, acrylic block on there for a little bit just to give it a little extra oomph. And then... I'm going to go ahead and cut off the branding strip, but then I have this like rainbow of hearts uh, strip from the cut apart sheet. And I was like, oh, I really like this. So instead of cutting the paper down to 12 by 12 first, I'm going to use my T-square ruler, find out where the end of the 12 by 12 paper should be, put my border strip on there, and then cut that that strip off the bottom to make it a 12 by 12 layout. So that is going to do it for my layout today. Uh, it's a little different than the sketch, but I do feel like you can definitely kind of see where the inspiration came from. So if you have any questions, please leave them down below. Make sure you check out the description box. That's where you'll find all the links to Sandy as well as the Facebook group for the sketches. And remember to wear your crown and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.